Um, hi there. I'm Sydney Wheeler from Black Tree TV. How are you guys today? Good. Hi, Sydney. Great. Hi, Sydney. Hi. I am so excited to get to talk to you both today. I wanted to start off by saying I read the books as a kid. I watched a TV show as a teenager, and now as an adult, I get to dive into this new chapter of Pretty Little Liars. So excited. I wanted to ask you, what made you want to get your feet wet, you know, diving into the world of A, or both of you? Okay. Uh, I, I, I'll talk fast. Uh, I, no, I was approached by my bosses uh, to see if I would be interested in um, uh, uh, doing a new version of it. And I, obviously I knew about the show. I wasn't a super fan like, like, like you, but it was obviously a, a pop culture phenomenon. And I started watching the original series as an adult. And I was like, this is so compulsively entertaining. And I'm like, and I get why I'm, 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 they're asking me to, to do it because obviously a lot of the stuff that I've done was though not intentionally or subconsciously influenced by the original PLL. So I very quickly reached out to, or to connected with Lindsay about it. And we found a way in by doing a new, exploring a new genre, which we both love, which is horror and slasher. And I was like, oh, this could be, this could be really cool. So that's what got me really, really excited about it. Yeah. A thousand percent. I think, um, you know, definitely as a fan of the original show, being a fan of mystery shows, a fan of YA and coming of age, and then the opportunity to do this with Roberto, who um, is a, such a, an amazing leader, showrunner and, and writer, but also we shared a passion for horror that we got to um, investigate writing together on Sabrina. And so the opportunity to reimagine this as a horror slasher show to create new characters while honoring the original um, was super exciting for me. Awesome. And what does it feel like delivering for a show that already has such an established audience? Yeah. I mean, I'll, I'll say I'll, 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 it's daunting, you know yeah. what I mean? And you want to, and, and, and it's such a passionate, incredibly uh, uh, large uh, uh, fan base and you, and, and, and with the show that's as iconic as, as, as Pretty Little Liars is with that cast that is so like such an, that was such an iconic cast of stars, uh, uh, you, you know, you want to, you want to uh, honor that and yeah. celebrate it. And, uh, you know, you don't want to try to repeat it. Um, it's a, that's a, that's not a good way. We didn't, we never wanted a new Allison, a new Aria. We didn't want any, 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 any of that. Uh, and you just kind of want to want to expand the, the 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 universe that's there. 
Yeah, I do. I do think daunting is, is right. I, I think that Roberto and I both felt a responsibility to those fans, knowing how rabid they are, knowing how much they love the original. And that is why we wanted to expand the universe, set this in a new town with new characters, but hope that we can make fans of the original proud, that we uh, gave honor to some of the original DNA of the original show while, while still blazing a new path. And, and there's so much love uh, for the original characters and hopefully room in their hearts for these new girls as well. Awesome. And last question for Roberto. What are you most excited for fans to experience this season? I'm most excited for the fans to meet and fall in love with these girls. Yeah. They are all superstars. Uh, they, we, Lindsay and I became obsessed with them when they popped into our Zoom boxes and read these <laughs> words. But, uh, but we love these characters and, and, and you just want to be part of that friend group with these, with these, with these young, incredible actresses. That's what I'm most excited about. Absolutely. Well, thank you so much for your time. Of course. Thank you, Sydney.